Okay, open control panel, Google security, system and security, and system, uh, open device manager, go to keyboard, right click on the Japanese keyboard, update driver software, browse my computer, let me pick, show compatible devices and hardware, uncheck that, go down to the bottom, choose 102 keyboard, click next, yes, close, yes, restart, right click computer properties, device manager, keyboard, right click update driver, browse, let me pick, Japanese keyboard, next, close, and restart. Start, control panel, change keyboard, change keyboard, add, show more, Japanese, okay, 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 now when we open a text document, start typing, you can see when you press shift Two, you'll get the at key, that symbol, whatever it is, and then if we go down to the keyboard icon here, you can change that to Japanese, and instead of the at two, uh, shift two gets an at symbol. You'll now get what you see on the keyboard here. So. Shift and 2 will get the 6699 speech marks, whatever you want to call them. There you go. And that goes with all the other punctuation. If you want to get what you see, change it to Japanese. And if you want to get what you're used to, or you're plugging in a USB US keyboard, set it to US and in control panel you can set whichever one's going to default when the computer starts. Thanks for watching.